Welcome to our channel NKC Insight. Every year June 19 celebrating National Watch Day, the day was founded by Nordstrom and the day to celebrate the history and design of watchmaking. This would be recognizing an industry that has been around for more than 500 years and is steadily evolving. Even with the advent of smartphones and smartwatches, the classic wristwatch signals individual taste, culture, and a rich history that cannot be disputed. Many watches also provide a great deal of information beyond the basics of time and date. Some watches include alarms. Other elaborate and more expensive watches, both pocket and wrist models, also incorporate striking mechanisms or repeater functions. Wrist watches are one of the most important devices in the daily lives of human beings. It is required for keeping the track of the time during the day or the night. One of the big advantages of a watch especially over a smartphone is how long it can operate in the field. Many watches are made to either be self-powered through motion or use a small amount of energy from a battery. The best watches do not use the latest technology. They are powered by ingenious mechanical clockwork technology that predates electricity. Wrist watches make it easier for them to display their sense of style. They are a form of self-expression, reflecting a hint of danger, adventure and sports depending on the make of the watch. Art on a watch can come in multiple forms. The dial can literally be a painting, or the design of the instrument itself is pure art. For many people, the movement arouses as much fascination as the dial and case. Compared to electronic movements, mechanical watches are less accurate, often with errors of seconds per day, and they are sensitive to position, temperature, and magnetism. A mechanical movement uses an escapement mechanism to control and limit the unwinding and winding parts of a spring, converting what would otherwise be a simple unwinding into a controlled and periodic energy release. Traditional mechanical watch movements use a spiral spring called a mainspring as a power source. In manual watches the spring must be rewound periodically by the user by turning the watch crown. Antique pocket watches were wound by inserting a separate key into a hole in the back of the watch and turning it. A self-winding or automatic watch is one that rewinds the mainspring of a mechanical movement by the natural motions of the wearer's body. The first self-winding mechanism was invented for pocket watches. Automatic watch is a purely mechanical movement consisting of 51 parts, including a novel self-winding mechanism with a transparent oscillating weight. So far, it is the only mechanical movement manufactured entirely on a fully automated assembly line. Electronic movements, also known as quartz movements, have few or no moving parts, except a quartz crystal which is made to vibrate by the piezoelectric effect. The combination with some electronic components, it functions as an oscillator. It resonates at a specific highly stable frequency, which is used to accurately pace a timekeeping mechanism. Electronic watches require electricity as a power source, and some mechanical movements and hybrid electronic mechanical movements also require electricity. Usually, the electricity is provided by a replaceable battery. The first use of electrical power in watches was as a substitute for the mainspring. Swiss luxury watchmaker makes the Silen T wristwatch with a touch-sensitive face that vibrates to help the user to tell time eyes free. The bezel of the watch features raised bumps at each hour mark, after briefly touching the face of the watch, the wearer runs a finger around the bezel clockwise. When the finger reaches the bump indicating the hour, the watch vibrates continuously, and when the finger reaches the bump indicating the minute, the watch vibrates intermittently. Thanks for watching this video, follow us in Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter by clicking the link mentioned below in the description of our channel also subscribe our channel for more videos.